We have continuing coverage of a story we told you about earlier this month. The future is looking a lot brighter for some horses rescued from neglect and starvation earlier this year in Fillmore County. KIMT News 3's resident horseman George Mallet is here with the update, and it's a good update, George. We're it, happy it, about it this one. It absolutely is, Raquel. The, the original story focused on one horse in particular. Her name is Luda, a now beautiful chestnut filly just three years old. Not only has Luda got a new home, she earned that new home by winning a pretty intense Minnesota competition known as the Trainer's Challenge. This part of her body was just soft. Like, I've never experienced that before. We introduced you to Shaler Alley earlier this month. Just like people, they want to feel a purpose. He was the trainer readying Luda here for a new life. She's probably put on 150 or 200 pounds. We showed you pictures of how the starving three-year-old mare looked back in March. Her feet had been neglected and um, they, they were starting to affect joints, so they were a little bit, she was a little bit splayed out. She was among seven horses removed from a Fillmore County farm by the Minnesota Hooved Animal Rescue Foundation. To find homes for these previously unwanted horses. The group's mission was fulfilled when Luda and other rescued horses strutted their stuff at the annual Trainers Challenge. They've had all the training they need. Um, they are ready to go to new homes. They're vetted. They've had their dentals done, their shots, their coggins. They're ready for a new life. Luda won the Trainers Challenge outright. It's a real opportunity to give her a good future. The one starving mare trotting and loping resolutely toward a new home giving her a chance to kind of have a forever home and um, not have to re-experience the trauma that she's been through. Lovely Luda deserved nothing less. Now, I spoke with Drew Fitzpatrick of the Minnesota Hooved Animal Rescue Foundation late yesterday. She told me there were roughly 18 horses in the trainer's challenge and that Luda took first place. She was adopted quickly, so somebody really made out. She's only three years old, sound, and now well-trained to boot, huh? Oh, yeah, what a great story. A great ending for her and some of those other horses that were rescued as well. Thank yeah. you so much, George. And of the seven horses rescued in Fillmore County, Fitzpatrick tells us three of them now have new homes.